All right, well, if you don't have any Saturday plans just yet, you can spend it helping save lives. The Phoenix Heart Walk is back in person after two years of COVID cancellations. Team 12's Jess Winters joining us live at the Wesley Bolin Memorial Plaza, where this all kicks off tomorrow. Jess, good morning. Tell us about it. Hey, good morning to you guys. Yes, it's quiet out right now, but picture this. Thousands of people will be out here tomorrow morning. It is all to raise awareness and funds for heart disease and stroke. Heart disease remains the number one killer in the U.S. One person dies every 36 seconds. Now, one Phoenix mom, this is a mission that's very close to her heart, so she's going to be leading the charge on Saturday morning. Nicole Blossie's daughter, Addison Blossie, has a congenital heart defect. At five years old, she's already had two open heart surgeries with more ahead of her. Nicole says she couldn't even take Addison home from the hospital for eight months after she was born. It's a time in her life she still struggles to talk about. She's a superhero, you know, she's been through a lot and she's been through more than any child should have to go through, but I know she's not the only one and that's why it's just so important to stay strong to this mission and spread awareness. Glossy says she had to fight for answers when it comes to her daughter's health issues, which is why she uses Addison's story to encourage others to do the same. Festivities kick off tomorrow at 8 a.m., but the actual walk starts at 9 a.m. It is a 5K, so only three miles. We can do it, right? And the money raised will go toward things like CPR training and also heart research. We'll have more coming up at 6.30, but for now, we're live in Phoenix. Jess Winters, Today in AZ.